Welcome once again to our daily devotional on this Holy Thursday morning. I am Gomati Chulhan, greeting you in the wonderful name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. I am a member of the Revival Time Assembly, which is a member church of the Pentecostal Assemblies of the West Indies. Being a disciple of Christ is not an easy one. Luke chapter 14 tells us that a disciple is someone who has surrendered to Christ, someone who loves the Lord and is wholly dedicated to Him. As disciples, we have a divine responsibility to live the gospel of Jesus Christ, to care for those in need, to invite all to receive the gospel, to unite families for eternity and to teach others about Jesus. However, as we move forward, we tend to become weak at times when faced with situations. We tend to be ignorant or void of understanding or even allow peer pressure to take over and to guide us into making wrong or inappropriate decisions. Let's take a look at Peter. Peter was the first disciple of Jesus. He was a bold and charismatic leader. He was grounded in his faith and had a higher level of belief in Jesus than the other disciples. Peter faltered when he denied Jesus. Here we learn that Christians falter at times, but the key is to return to Jesus and ask for forgiveness and strengthen our faith. As disciples, we will encounter challenges, but instead of bragging, be committed step by step as you grow in your knowledge of God's word and in your faith. Be authentic. Don't attempt to make yourself look better. Be trustworthy. Trust each other in the, within that group of disciples. Be realistic and prayerful. We must remember when we associate with Jesus as his disciples, our behavior, values, and character start to change. Love plays an important part. John chapter 13 verse 35 tells us, By this shall all men know that ye are my disciples, if ye have love one to another. Jesus says here that our Christ-like love will show that we are his disciples. Be unselfish. Be self-sacrificing. Deny self. Win souls. This will help you to become more like Jesus. Forget the past behaviors, values, identities, and relationships that may cause you to backslide or develop ungodly characters. Turn to Jesus today. Become more like him. Read his word. Let us pray. Lord, we thank you today for your word, the Holy Spirit and your son, Jesus Christ for helping us to become better disciples to deal with our weaknesses and challenges in mentoring others. Father, continue to guide and strengthen us to become more Christ-like and display a more godly character and that Christ-like love that Jesus displayed when he was on it. All these things I ask in your holy and precious name. Amen. Enjoy the rest of your day today.